Hello everybody and welcome to episode 4 of Stadium Spotlight. This is a show where we look at different unique stadiums in the show 22 and today we are at Roy Holiday Field in Dunedin, Florida and this stadium is a tribute to the late and great Hall of Famer Roy Holiday. So if you enjoyed this series, please consider liking and subscribing as we are super close to 1000 subs. If you want me to look at your own stadium, make sure to put your online ID in the name of the stadium in the comments below and I'll be sure to look it up. And with that, let's get right on to the tour. So this stadium seats 42,000 people. The wall dimensions is 339 down the left field line, 399 to dead center with 404 being the furthest distance. And then down the right field line, it is 330. And real quick, let's take a look at behind home plate. We have some concessions at the top of the lower bowl. Right field, we have a building with some billboards on it and the name of the stadium and Roy Holiday's name on the side of it with a statue right in the middle of this open area. We also have a sky cart on top of the building that connects to center field. We'll look at that later. So in right field, we have three layers of seats and I found this really cool. He used the top of, of a building as seating and I honestly didn't think of using that as my seats. Also, it has like steps going up to the seats honestly i really like the look of it got a strikeout meter with a scoreboard right in the middle and we have some concessions at the top as well going over to right field we have more concessions and more seats and we have a little party deck in right center field with some shade center field we have the old rangers batter's eye with a scoreboard right above it and i really like the lighting that kind of wraps around the outfield left center field we have a scoreboard American flag more concessions and then we have some picnic seating in left center field we'll try not to uh, select all of those trees but it had to be tedious adding all these trees right here these are all individually placed I believe and I'm I don't know what I'm pretty sure that's like like corn I guess <laughs> really like the look of it and I also like the concourse in left field moving over to the foul territory on the field we have a bunch of concessions with some ticket entrances we also have some shaded area over here with some seats some plants rubbing around the fence and then a four deck restaurant here in this open area really nice view from it <laughs> and the same lights that wrap around the outfield also wrap around the top of the stadium and there's one thing you cannot miss i can't believe he went out of his way and did this he added another stadium in the background i would not have put this much commitment into the stadium but he built a second stadium here which is freaking insane. He has some picnic seating in left field with some scoreboards. Got a parking garage and some suites that wrap around the stadium. Here's an idea. I don't know. I wouldn't do this if I were you, if you're watching this. What if you built a second stadium with that one being the background stadium instead of this? Like build this one as the playable stadium and then rebuild that, <laughs> the other stadium as the background stadium. I know there'd be so much work. I wouldn't personally do it myself, but that would be dope. And then we have a light tower basically just lighting up the parking garage and the stadium so the guy built two stadiums in one which is insane so that's pretty much it for the inside of the stadium so i'm gonna take y'all a view on the outside here's the view from behind home plate View from center field. And here is the bird's eye view. And here is the stadium in Road to Show just to show y'all what the stadium looks like in gameplay. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed the series, please consider liking and subscribing as we are super close to a thousand subs. If there's a stadium that you want me to look at, put your online ID in the name of the stadium in the comments below and I'll be sure to look it up and potentially be in my next video. And with that, thank you guys so much for watching and I will catch y'all in the next video. Peace!